I do what I do because that's just how I roll. I could have retired years ago, but I don't know what I would do with myself. I do it for the sheer joy of discovery. My name is Bob Lefkowitz. I'm a physician scientist, and I have been on the faculty of Duke University since 1973. Throughout my career, my research has involved drug receptors. Receptors are molecules on the surface of cells with which drugs interact. We often talk about them in the uh, image of a lock and a key, where the drug is the key and the receptor is a lock, which fits it uh, with a great deal of specificity. When I began my research, there was no real evidence that receptors existed. And I spent the first uh, decades of my research career uh, trying to prove that they existed, an effort which obviously was successful, and in the process discovered what is now known to be the largest family of drug receptors. They're called G-protein coupled receptors. There are a thousand different members of this receptor family. They include receptors for smell and taste, uh, as well as receptors for drugs. Amongst the thousand different receptors in this family would be such things as the receptors for adrenaline, histamine, serotonin, dopamine, and many, many other substances. It turns out that these receptors uh, are the largest uh, class of targets for drugs that are used in clinical medicine today. So the research has had a, a huge impact uh, societally in, in that many of the drugs that are commonly used today uh, was based on the research that we've done uh, over the past 40 or so years. This research would not have been possible without federal funding. In fact, the original grant that I received for this work from the federal government, from the NIH in 1973, is still active today. So federal funding for my research has been essential, and I think I can say with some confidence that were it not for this federal funding, I would not have received the Nobel Prize in chemistry for my work in 2012. I think it's worth underscoring that uh, federal funding for research is absolutely essential and is of huge societal benefit because virtually all the discoveries which uh, advance clinical medicine today are made in the basic research laboratory and almost uh, none of these discoveries would have been possible without federal funding.